Hi, uh, radio broadcasters. Thank you for checking out this video. We're going to quickly go over how to set up Nextcast if you're using Live 365. Um, so the steps are very simple. This is going to go very quick, but I just wanted to do a quick video um, in case someone gets stuck. So the first thing you need to do, go to Live 365. I'm going to go ahead and uh, log into my account. And then I'm going to go to my station. Once I have my station status screen open, I'm going to go to sources and then I'm going to click on live DJ. Now, these are the settings that I'm going to enter into Nextcast. So we're going to go over to Nextcast and we're going to hit the broadcast settings button that will bring up this window. We're going to go ahead and set this to encoder one. Now, the first thing we want to do is set the type to Live 365 2017. So that is the new Live 365 format. So then I'm going to go back to the website and I'm actually going to move these windows here so you can see both. I'm going to copy the host name to the um, clipboard. And then here where it says server path, press control V or paste. And then after you do every change, you can hit save to ensure that that setting is saved. Again, I'm going to hit the clipboard on port. I'm going to paste the port number and save the mount point right here. Copy the clipboard, paste right here to mount point, save. Username is source. It's already in there going to copy my password and paste it here. I'm also going to paste the, the password here. Okay. Now, once I've done this and I've saved it, I can hit enable encoder and uh, you want to make sure to hit auto reconnect because if there's any hiccup in the um, internet, either um, on either side, it will try to auto reconnect. And so we're going to go ahead and load a rotation here and um, basically then it will get started we're going to go the lower the volume for licensing purposes okay um just one other thing here is you can fill enter your station name your station website genre and description some other encoders like that information uh, a note on tune in if you don't have a tune in account please do not enable this um, it's not going to help at all you just have to make sure if you do have a tune in account you can put your station id partner id and partner key and that will uh, send the metadata to uh, tune in radio well that's it that's how you get connected with live 365 using nextcast